everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I am so excited to be filming today. I finally received my Ipsy bag and I could not wait to get this for you guys. Now I know this video is just a little bit late going up today, but you know, it's just been a really super busy week. My son, my oldest son, he has summer school. My daughter has dance camp and I have just been running back and forth like crazy. I get so excited every time I get a new Ipsy bag. I just, uh, it's like Christmas every month. So, all right. All right, per usual, I have masks on the outside of my bag because of course they do not fit inside. So this is the BioBell uh, facial mask, perfect radiance with chocolate, mulberry, and honey. Hashtag unicorn glow. All right, there's two masks. This is vegan and cruelty free and it also says it's anti-pollution. So that'll be fun to try. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that. Looks like a big old cavity in that cup. <laughs> so, but it'll be interesting to try. Um, maybe I will just go ahead and try one and I'll keep the other one for a future giveaway. All right, so this is the bag this month right here. I love this bag. I think it is a perfect representation of summer just because of the fact that it has the bright colors and the color selection that they chose for this bag really screams summertime to me. So I'm super excited about that. It does have a little heart tab, which I think is so cute. And it says Ipsy, of course. But let's just go ahead and dive right in. I'm going to go ahead and remove the card. Um, and this month is Pride Month. And this is Flying Colors. So that's the card right there. I'm just going to read a little bit of the back. It says, at Ipsy, Pride Month is about so much more than sexuality. It's about unique beauty, self-expression, and inspiring everyone to be completely themselves without fear of judgment. That's why we're highlighting seven LGBTQ creators who know what makes them different is also what makes them beautiful. That is so awesome. Um, but that's just the beginning. There's still so much work to do to educate the world on love, acceptance, and tolerance. Together, we're making strides every day. Whether you're marching in a pride parade, out and proud, supporting your friends and loved ones, or just starting to learn about the LGBTQ movement, um, we hope that your flying colors, glam bag, and all the stories on ipsy.com will inform, empower, and motivate you to be your best, most loving, vibrant self this June. Hashtag Ipsy Flying Colors. That is a great card. That is perfect for this month. You know, don't be afraid to be who you are. Love who you are. Be proud. You are beautiful inside and out. And oh, that card really moves me. So let's just go ahead and dive right into the bag. We're getting all emotional. I haven't even made it into the bag. All right. The first thing ah, is a brush. Okay. So this is a Luxie brush. Um, it is a small shader brush. It's the Luxie 245. 245 small shader brush. Um, so the handle is really small, which I mean, it's okay. Um, it's got a little nice weight to it. It is a little bit smaller than what I typically use. Let's see what I use today. Um, where is, there we go. So see the difference? <laughs> no, hello, can you see the difference? There we go. So you see this one right here is a little bit bigger than that one, um, but I could definitely use this and get a little bit more precise on the eye. So I like that. Love getting brushes. So, and especially Luxie brushes. I really enjoyed the other Luxie brush that I have had gotten from Ipsy um, in a previous bag. So anytime I get a Luxie brush, I'm super happy about that. All right. And the next item is an eyeliner, of course. Um, this is Beauty For Real. Hmm. Eyeline 24 7 eyeliner. Does it say what color? Whiskey. Color whiskey. So <clears throat> let's see if I can open up this tab. <gasps> I've never been able to do that. Oh my gosh. I know that's like crazy, but. Um, usually I'm like ripping a little bit, ripping a little bit, ripping a little bit. I literally just pulled that in one little, I just literally pulled that one time and boom, it is off. So 
<laughs> that is like, that is awesome for me because I, I hate sitting here struggling with packaging. That just like irritates me so bad. So um, this looks like it's a brownish shade. More like a coppery shade. So it is kind of like a coppery shade. Um, I know it looks brown on camera, but it's got like a hint of the copper shade to it. So it feels really, really creamy. Um, look, if I could show you. All right, so look how easy it swipes on. That's a bad swatch, but you can see how easy it is. It did not skip like at all bad swatch but it didn't skip so um i'm really excited for that and once again that is by the brand beauty for real and it is made in the usa so um i know a lot of people like to look for uh, certain makeup that is made for in the usa so you might want to look up beauty for real eyeliner all right we got two items in the bag i'm going to go for kind of the bigger item um, this is from Pixi. It is their Skin Treats Glow Tonic Exfoliating Toner. All right, that's exciting. I've heard actually really good stuff about Pixi's toner, and it's a pretty decent size. Um, almost the palm of my hand. Um, let's see. Does it tell me how many ounces? I get... 0.5 fluid ounces so not a bad sample at all I wonder what it smells like okay well I had to poke a hole through it, it smells like <laughs> okay um, if you go to a hotel and you know how they have like those little bar of hand soaps on the um, by the sink that's what it smells like to me. It smells like a little bar of hand soap, so <laughs> we will see. But I'm still pretty excited to try that out. The last thing that we have is, ooh, it is a lip stain. I don't know if I've ever tried a lip stain. I know I've tried glosses and lipsticks, um, liquid lipsticks, but I don't actually think I have tried a lip stain. This is in the color Holiday Getaway, so um, this is by Douse, 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 I don't know. Let's swatch this for you guys. See, I just pulled that off and I gave me just a little bit of plastic. I'm going to be sitting here pulling this crap off for a minute, so I'll be right back. All right, so I am back. A luscious lip stain. Doesn't really have a... I don't know. I don't know if I like that smell. Hmm. I don't. I. I, I don't know what that smells like. But. God. Ooh. <laughs> that is a bright summer color. Look at that. <laughs> that is so pretty. But it is in the orange category, and I really have a hard time with orange lips. I did a video. I know I mentioned products I regret buying is kind of like all the orange lip products that I have just because of the fact that I'm really not creating looks for an orange lip. That really needs to be one of my focuses um, on a future video so I can use those lipsticks that I have. But I mean, it's still a very pretty color. Very, very pretty. But, I mean, I'm, I'm still going to give it a try. I still think it's really pretty. I'm interested to see how the lip stain performs. So, uh, let's go back over the bag. So, we have the two-pack facial masks. We have the Luxie brush, which, of course, I love. We have the eyeliner, which is a really, really nice eyeliner. Um, I like the color. I like the fact that it doesn't skip. It's very smooth. Um, then we have the Douse Luscious Lip Stain. Um, and the Pixi Glow Tonic Exfoliating Toner. So I would say that this month's bag is really good. I'm really excited for this bag. Um, I think all the products are definitely something that I can use, something I would enjoy, and they all match my profile. So I'm super excited for this bag. Um, and like I said, of course, this fits the summertime theme uh, with the colors that they chose. So that is it for this video. If you did like it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the 
the subscribe button before you go. You can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter, and I'll have those all linked down below for you guys. And I will see you on my next video. Bye!